Hello and welcome to Unstop Wrestling Chat. My name is Barry and today we're here to speak about NXT. Takeover number 36 from last night. Guys, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and that beautiful notification bell. First of all, a quick apology for this being up a little bit later. <coughs> My computer for some reason this morning just decided it didn't want to work. Now we're working and we're here. Anyway guys, why we're here, go to the comments below. Let me know what you thought about NXT. Did you enjoy it last night? Do you think could have been better? What was your favourite match from it? And let's get into the review. So, the million dollar title match is what we kick off with. Cameron Grimes versus LA Knight. Grimes gets a win. Two stars. Good match. It was, wasn't was too long. Wasn't too short. It was just there. I'm not really invested in this story at all, to be honest with you. But it done what it had to do. And it was, it was good for what it had to do. And then we got the women's title... Dakota Kai versus Gonzalez. Gonzalez got the win. Two stars. Uh, Kay Lee Ray. Takes me ages to get that name right. Came out after it. Kind of pretty much chat, ready to challenge for Gonzalez's uh, title. That was good to be honest with you. I enjoyed this one. I can only give it two stars like I say. It was enjoyable. It didn't overstay its welcome. It was never going to be a match of the night given the card that's on there, but um, it was fun. So next we have my match of the night, 4.5 stars, uh, Walter versus Dragonov. Dragonov gets the win. This was amazing. This was fantastic. This was what we like to see. They're just two guys beating the shit out of each other um, and putting on a fucking classic match. This is the second match. Go watch the first one. I feel the first one could have been a little bit better than this one. I'm not going to split hairs. The two of them were good, but the first one was good. The second one was good, and I hope this is going to set up for a third one. Um, I love watching these guys work in the ring. They're fantastic, and this was fantastic. 4.5 stars, like I say, is pretty high for me, and I really enjoyed this one. So, Kyle O'Reilly versus Adam Cole. O'Reilly gets a win. 3.5 stars I'm giving this. I feel it went a touch too long, but... Is this Cole's last match in NXT? More than likely it could have been. There's rumours that he's not signed a new contract. Um, and if it is, it's a really good way to go out. But it was a fantastic match and he's made O'Reilly look great. But O'Reilly still feels like he's missing something. Anyway guys, I really enjoyed this one. Go check it out. And let me know, did you think it went a little bit too long or not? Then we got the NXT title, the main event, Karrion Cross versus Samoa Joe. I gave us a 3.5. Samoa Joe got the win. Fantastic match. Um, I enjoyed it. It told a story. That's the way it was more fantastic. It told a story. And also the fact that Samoa Joe was the NXT champion. I'm more than happy with that. But on the flip side of it, the reason I took it down to a 3.5... You know what? We're going to make it a 3 stars, guys. The reason I took it down to a 3 star is Joe getting the win. They've took that off of Karrion Cross just to give Joe the win when there could have been something else added in there. Cross is obviously going to go to the main roster. Joe getting the belt, he's going to drop it to a younger guy and make them look good. So it makes sense, but what's Cross going to do in the main roster? He's literally been 50-50 booked up there. If it was me, I'd bring him in with Scarlett to go against Damian Priest for the belt there and let them just put on great matches because those two guys can Overall, I'm going to say a 3.5 stars for me. I enjoyed this one. I thought it was good. Walter and Dragov stole the show, saved the show, and j just really, really, yeah, they stole the show and they saved the show for me personally. I really enjoyed that one the most. What's next for NXT? Who knows? Are they going to be changing back to where they were before? Are, are they going to be becoming better? Or, or as rumours are saying, NXT that we know and love is done. Who knows what's going to happen? But last night, if it was a final pay-per-view and that style that we all love, it was a good goodbye. And I hope it doesn't be a good goodbye. I hope we keep up that great style that we really enjoy. So what did you think about NXT, guys? Did you enjoy it? For me, Walter and Dragov, uh, Dragunov stole the show. That fantastic match. Anything other than that. There was good moments. Adam Cole, O'Reilly, obviously. Joel Cross. These were good matches. But Walter and Dragunov stole the show for me, and I think they were match of the night. And if I'm going to be honest, 
I think it's match of the weekend from obviously the Friday, Saturday, Sunday of the kind of wrestling mega weekend that we had. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoy the rest of your day and I'll see you back here later on today for my Monday Night Wars Retro Review. See you later guys.